Hey guys, uh, welcome back. So, yeah, things have been going pretty good. Uh, I think at the end of the last episode, we were just... Um, we just got the portal done. I think that's pretty much the only thing we did last episode. So, I've got a few bits and pieces to show you guys. I've done a little bit more work with the portal room. Uh, as you can see, I've got sort of set up space ready for lots of them. Um... But I have four sitting here at the moment. Uh, first one is the nether. Um, I figure I'm going to need a nether portal, so we'll put that in here as well. Next one's the savannah and mesa, which is the red rock place. I think I was calling it the barrens before. This is the one we set up in the last episode. Uh, I've also got two more. Um, so I've just gone out for little walks. Uh, these aren't too far away. Um, you could probably walk to them and back in one, in one set of daylight, maybe just about but um but yeah it's a lot quicker so we go through here we come out and this is the icy hills biome um so i don't think i've we've seen this yet in the series so the icy hills biome is pretty cool uh, it does naturally spawn uh, these snow golems which is pretty cool um it's a bit odd though because these trees obviously are just ice you've got the leaves aren't and then the branches are just normal ice that smashes into water um, but it's pretty cool it's not really a lot here what is cool though is that mining I've been mining uh, down there and I found some I think it was called tanzanite so I think the only um, biomes of plenty ore that I'd gotten so far was um, peridot I believe whereas now I have some tanzanite uh, the tanzanite is I just need to get all of them to be able to create the staff that lets me go to this promised land this other dimension thing now this part here is the uh, dead swamps biome uh, dead swamp biome is cool um, you can chop down these this is absolutely fine these wood the wood from this is dead wood though and you can't turn it into planks so I'm not quite sure if it has any other use or if it's just it's just there but yeah so you can you can chop down the dead wood but it doesn't take a minute take you far now the other place I'm just wondering I'll go back through I think we'll use this as this is what we've got set up oh. drop down there and we'll go back through here now this one is the cherry blossom grove and pasture I found another pasture biome um, obviously untouched by me and unruined not ruined by me um, so this through here is another place um, I think this is pretty cool. I like the cherry blossom grove. It's quite pretty. Um, oh, what are those? Anemone. Hmm, how odd. Okay, and tulips, I've already picked some of those up. Um, I've realised there's some more you can do with the flowers, apart from turn them into dyes. There's like, sort of pretty... Have, oh, what's this? And clover. I think I need daisies to make like a little flowery headdress, which is quite cool. But yeah, so you've got this cherry blossom thing. It's quite cool because you get pink wood um, the cherry blossom wood is is pink, which is quite cool. So you've got lots of different bits, and then the pastures are over this way. I say I haven't really explored the pastures. Obviously, in the pastures, I know you get peridot. I'm assuming it's by biome, but I don't know what you might get mining in um, the cherry blossom cherry blossom grove. But yeah, I thought I'd show you those. I was quite chuffed. I'm, I'm happy with how the portal room is coming along. Um, I think it's it's quite a cool little feature. Now where was we? We were down here. We run back through here. And yeah, so I was quite chuffed with this. I think it's pretty cool. Um, it's quite smart. Like I said, I've got lots of room. There are, I think it was like over 80. Might even be like significantly more. I'm not sure. 80 biomes. So hopefully these will build up. The only problem is it does use up it's quite resource hungry so it's not just the ender pearls that it uses up a lot of um, I have had um, a stack and a bit of obsidian and I'm down to 11 that's uh, it's sort of gone pretty quick um, diamond wise it uses a lot of diamonds um, we've got an alright stack, ah oh, here we go this is the tanzanite yeah so we've got peridot and tanzanite the, um, let's have a quick look where is it Ah, here's, here's the staff. So the, the staff, 
uses the three bits and pieces. So you've got the staff topper. We need a nether star, ruby, topaz, and end stone. And then um, the next bit down, peridot, appetite, oh, and end stone again. And then the bottom bit, um, sapphire, tanzanite, and end stone again. So obviously we've got it. We need it, a nether star and end stone. So we've got to do um, weather and end dragon and stuff at some point. But I want to get these ruby and topaz after. A little bit of exploration so what I'm going to do is see if I can't one two three four for the piece five six seven eight nine ten and I need another two okay so what we're gonna do we're gonna go down and grab some more obsidian and then hopefully get another portal set set up so that I can go exploring a bit further and then set up a portal to get back again um, so let's I'm pretty sure though I had a yeah down here I, I think I had a lava pool I've cleared out quite a few close by so here we go we're good right let's grab some of these which one's the efficiency one Oh, I don't want to waste the fortune. I'll use the end one. Here we go. Grab some of this. So what I'll probably do is I'll cut back in when I've got the um, obsidian. Save you guys watching me fail at it. Um, yeah, so I'll see you in a sec. Hey guys, so i got my uh, obsidian. Um, as you may be able to tell out here, and by the random inventory that I've got and the fact that half of my bits and pieces have gone off the side here I just had a creeper uh, in here um, I'm not quite sure how or where it came from the, my only thoughts were I had a path leading I've put a door on here now just in case they've come through the portals If that, I don't know if that's a thing might have to test it out but I did have a path leading up here and there might have been some dark spots up there um, that's the point so uh, yeah that's <laughs> yeah worried me a little but um yeah so i've got my i've got my um obsidian let me just find which chest i put it in i kind of gathered all my stuff up quickly just in case um that 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 ender pearls in that one flint where did that go irons there um, red dye and I've got blue dye cool and paper 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 did I have any it's a nightmare yeah fun times I didn't even notice it I didn't didn't hear it coming at all that should be enough Right, let's get to crafting some of this lot. I should need... Oh! I need to do my purple dye first. There. And another one. Then another one of these. Sorry, as you can tell, I've made a few. For every portal, well, you have to do um, all of this effectively. Uh, there we go. Oh, redstone. Um, and glowstone. Need to do this first. I need more glowstone. Bum, bum, bum. Right, let's hope that I've remembered this right. Don't think that matters which side it goes on. One of those and one of those. Yeah, cool. 
pop these on there then. There we go. Right, so I've got portal modifiers. I've got two upgrade cards which need these and I think yeah so travel to the same dimension awesome right so I've got travel to the same dimension I've got those I need a lever to go the other end and five of those to go the other end do I need anything else portal modifier put that in to allow travel oh I die what colour do I want what colour do we want the portal to be um, I wonder whether that gives white light grey let's try that cool so right, I'm not going to worry too much about the organisation I shall go through and do that off screen um, Alright, where did all my tools go? Which one did they go in? As I was clearing stuff out. There we go. Oh, not fussed about that. Take that just in case. I think I'm good. We'll soon find out. Right, so let's go here. Right, and we put one in there. Dimensional upgrade. Pop that there. One, two, three. Click to set a network. Redstone. Accept. Right, that's all done. Has that got it? It's got redstone on it. Good. Pop those up there. Pretty sure that's everything turn it on cool so I've got my grey one there and now I wanted to go out further this way I think I like this direction so yeah this is the um, the Savannah one this is the one you see me put in last time um, I think I will head further out in this direction I know there's a rainforest over this way so I might go to the other side of the rainforest biome and then put in the next one and then I've got a, a spot to go in exploring that one but yeah so this is how I did the other two effectively uh, I went, went, went walking for a while put down one then went back through that one and went walking a bit further um, oh, my crazy parkour skills coming into effect again don't worry if your parkour skills aren't quite as up to scratch as mine. It's um takes a lot of practice. So what have we got here? Oh wow, I haven't seen this. That's really cool. What's this? Fungi forest. And there's mushrooms. This is actually uh, the first time I've ever seen a mushroom in game because I've never found a... Uh, um, I oh, know, no, do you know what? I found a mushroom biome, but I think I died. Anyway, yeah, there's a few things that I've not come across. So we've got a good place here. Um, let's see if we can find this on... Oh, wow. What's that? Swamp flower. Cyan. Sweet. Um, let's see if we can find this bordering with another biome. And then uh, what I shall do is I shall put it in the... Uh, portal in between the two so what have we got here so what does this count as this counts as a more well we'll chuck it here because it might be that one of the ores that we want spawns is that an orange there's an orange flower up there as well isn't there so what have we got we've got a fungi forest let's bring this back up and keep it up we've got more Mycelium as well. No, okay. Fungi forest. Sweet. And then what is up here? Oh, eat. Let's 
head up this way. This is really cool. I do like all these different biomes. But these trees look different again, or are they part? They're part of the moor. And then this is rainforest. So we've got rainforest, fungi forest, and more. Do you know what? I'm going to put that, put it in the wall over here. Okay. Right, so we want that there, which means we need space. There, 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 there. Okay, and then we want that there. Set to the right one. Three. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I've um I put the wrong thing in. Okay. There we go. Out of the grey one. Awesome. So now we have our little entrance here. A little portal to go back. Sweet. So this one was uh Rainforest Fungi. <laughs> forest and more awesome so now we have yeah these three so what I should do is slowly get an idea uh, I shall slowly do some mining and bits and pieces in each of those places uh, and hopefully build up a stock of resources that you might only be able to get in those places but yeah thanks very much for watching guys um, I think I'm I'm sure whether or not I want to take on the wither next time and get the star. I think I might wait until I've got the stones. So I'm going to do some mining. So depending on how successful the mining is in each of these biomes, we'll see. But anyway, uh, thanks very much for watching. If you've enjoyed, make sure you click in the like. It 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 does make me feel good when there's a, a like on there. And if if you're not already, please do subscribe. Um, I'll see you later. Thanks very much. Bye.